Hey guys, welcome back. Look who I found back in that cave where we left her and I totally didn't notice at all. That is actually really impressive. I have to say, I, I applaud myself for being that completely blind and not paying attention in any way. Uh, it was actually quite a struggle to get her over here too. Because really you're supposed to take her from there to there. Um, but since I don't want to sell her into... Well, she's not going to slavery, but you know... Um, I, I want to set her free. I'm taking her down here. I'm not 100% sure if that's what you're supposed to do. I don't really remember. But I think... I think that's what you're supposed to do. Not positive, but that's... I'm going to try anyway. Um, because there's like a slave rescue outpost thing there. And, uh... Yeah. So I'm going to give that a shot. Uh, she won't talk to me. She's too frightened. You would think that I would be able to tell her that, hey, I, I'm actually just here to save you, you know, but I can't. So anyway, I'm going to rest until I'm healed, and unfortunately, I can't tell her to wait out here, so that kind of sucks because this, I think, is going to be kind of a hard dungeon. So I'm going to save right now, and uh, yeah, going to give this a shot. There's a really, really, really good reward in here, though. Unfortunately, I can't give her a weapon or anything. Uh, okay, stop that. Okay, it's a ghost. So that's not going to hit it. Dang it. She's totally gonna die. Quit punching the ghost. You can't hit it. And I can't use my... Well, I'm gonna have to cut, take the damage. Okay, so she's like almost dead now. Uh, okay, eh, not really useful. Maybe those are more useful than I think. I've never actually used them though. I'm gonna take one of those just so I can experiment and uh, see if I can figure out what they do. Because I did actually discover that uh, I picked up some things along the way, like these flowers. They're worth kind of a lot. Uh, I don't have any left, but I found two things that um, have a water walking effect, so I'll be able to make potions to do that. And, okay, there's nothing in this room. Nothing in that chest. There's usually nothing in the urns, but not always. Uh, Hellfire, that's a pretty good scroll. I'll save that for super emergencies. Okay, saving again. Just want to be extra sure. I wish I could tell her to just go wait in the corner and stop punching ghosts. Freaking retarded. Oh, it's a skeleton. Okay. Crossbow. Okay, knock. Oh my gosh, I hit her. Get out of the way. She. Did she die? No, she didn't die. I have to admit, she's very brave. When did that happen? I was I guess I wasn't looking at my health. I thought I was still pretty close to full though. Okay, that's why I saved. I'm gonna open the door and start off with I guess a fireball, because fire is freaking good. Okay. Well no we're not. Okay. I'm trying to dodge his Oh my gosh, he's strong. You're really making this hard on me, you stupid cat. Okay, I'm gonna try the fireball again, I just hope it works. Come on. If I cast it now, it's gonna hit her, and I'm, I'm stuck, I can't move. Okay, you're gonna have to tank, sorry. The thing is, I don't need a tank. If you would just run away, I could jump around the room and the freaking skeleton would never hit me. Stupid. Okay, uh, I'm gonna rest again. 11 hours, it's 3 p.m., that's not too bad. Hopefully it will be daytime when I make it to town. Or uh, it won't be night before I get there, whatever. Oh, I almost opened that. Okay, save. 
And I'm going to try out my new probe. I got two of these actually. And see if I can untrap this pot. Shut up. I, I don't know if traps have any specific level. They never say. Um, but, you know, I, I don't know, really. Um, so, yep, that's what we came for, the Minter's Ring. Uh, constantly fortifies intelligence and willpower by 10. I'm not sure if that'll count towards my uh, Mage's Guild advancement, but I do have more than 30 now, so I should be able to advance. Uh, also, I think Lord Bryn is an Easter egg. Uh, referring to some forum member back in like 2000, long time ago or something like that. I don't really know. Uh, on their site, and a petty soldier. I, I'll take that. It's not as good as I was hoping for, but I'll take it. Let me out. Okay, screw that. Just, just pretend I didn't do that. <laughs> Uh, there is a little thing there. I don't care about that. No. Although, how much money do I have? 191. Although I have a decent amount of stuff here. Once I get to town, I should have a good amount of money. For some reason, this little hallway really lags. Hopefully it's just that hallway. I can handle that if that's all it is. And it's not. Okay. Um, so yeah, I got this ring, and now I gain... Um, 10 Magicka from it. That's all I expected. Oh well, good enough. Uh, if anyone knows why the, <laughs> the lag keeps happening, it's definitely something to do with traps because I've played the game plenty without using it and it's always fine. And as soon as I stop recording, it's fine again. And I would just leave the mud crab alone, but she won't, so I don't have much of a choice. Okay, so now that we're done with that, uh, I'm just looking for someone out in the middle of the swamp. Actually, there's two people, come to think of it. Although the other one is, like, up there. Well, no, he's not. He's, he's like, right over here. I'll go to him first. <sighs> come on. Okay, I can't even do anything, so I'm going to... Stop the recording and close everything other than Morrowind. And hopefully I get this to work. Okay, I'm back. As soon as I stopped the recording, I instantly went up to 90 FPS. So, yeah. Really annoying. And these things are the water walking uh, effect plant that I found. So I'm going to be collecting those and that other kind of mushroom. Although I do have the spell, but you know. Uh, actually, this is the person I, I was look the first person I was looking for over here. Just in case, saving. And if she dies, I am cheating. I don't care. Because this is just retarded. The AI should not do that. Hello, Scribs. How you doing? Okay, so here he is. He's unfortunately dead. Uh, but he has a lot of money. And I'm gonna take that. And uh, have fun, dude. See ya. And another flower. Will I get lucky? Yes, I will. I mean, they're only worth 23, so... That's like 10 to 15 gold, but you know, whatever. I might as well pick it up. Um, okay, so he's like over here. 
somewhere. He, once we get to the path, he should show up. Although, you'll hear him before you see him. Uh, unless you're looking up. Maybe I can't see him there. Oh, I see him. I see him. There he is. Oh, that sucks. Hello, Tar Heel. Okay, so he has three uh, very interesting scrolls that actually fortify your acrobatics by 1,000 points for seven seconds. Meaning that if you cast this and then jump, you die because it takes longer than seven seconds to land. <laughs> and that's what just happened to him. So yeah, that sucks. Uh, I'm just gonna take everything. And you can read that if you want. Oh, I'm over covered. Well, your... Uh, sword kinda sucks. And your hat kinda sucks. How much does your book weigh? Four. <laughs> More than I expected. Um... Well, now I have to find stuff to drop. What did I pick up that was that much? Uh, everything. I was like, one away. Okay, whatever. And, uh... Um... Let's see. It's 20 and 100. I'm gonna drop that. And, uh, take... The robe. And the shoes. Can I take that? No, dang it. Goodbye, shirt. Uh... <laughs> Fine. I'll take off my own clothes. And I'll leave the rest. Okay. Trying to get as much money out of this as I can. 